good speed, and you don't see any any big overweight guys. These are young, lean guys ready to make a point. Bob, I I have been very very impressed with the level of competition here from the first match on. Really a tremendous show. Okay, in this match, this is a this is a uh, fourth match, fifth match of the evening. Okay, Tony Roy now entering the ring is going to be the opponent for. Jason the Horrible and his manager, the Bug. The Bug! <laughs> hey, Vic, Vic's not here. Do you suppose he's the Bug? There's the Bug! I don't know. I think Tony Roy's got his hands full in this match. I'll tell you, if Jason's half as bad looking as he is uh, in real life, takes that mask off, he'll probably scare a lot of people. Oh, the bug's got a fly swatter. I wonder what that means. <laughs> Maybe we can have a feature match later on with the bug against Vito. Uh, <laughs> I'm looking forward to that. Ah, uh, there's Jason. Scott and I saw him when we went to Marshfield. He's a vicious, vicious wrestler. I don't know if this other, the bug, this other guy is. The bug Tony is, ta uh, is like taunting the, Tony Roy as right much now. I like Tony Roy. I really don't think he's got a chance against the horrible one. Big size difference, too. Oh, Incredible. Size and psyche difference, I think, as well. <laughs> Wonder whether or not well, he's going to take that mask off. It's tough to beat somebody who doesn't feel oh, pain. No, he wrestles sure with that is. mask off. He what? He wrestles with that mask on. Is that correct? Yes, That's he correct. Does. Uh, Continental ca cable cameras are getting this right, uh, right up close and personal. Philadelphia. <laughs> <laughs> Frank's running our camera, Bob. With that first move, you'll see that Flying Tony Roy really needs to fly a lot in this match to stay away from Jason the Terrible. He cannot link up with him at all. Uh, he's gonna, he has to display a lot of quickness here. Oh, Tony showed nice, him. Good quickness, nice. good quickness. What an agile youngster he is. That's right. He's in good shape, too. Felt well, fine-tuned muscles. He's incredible. The bug trying to create a little problem from the outside. Right now, Jason just kind of stomping around the ring, pushing the referee out of the way. We're looking for a lockup here. It kick to the stomach by Jason, punch to the back of the head. Jason's style of wrestling is just pure brutality. This, we're not going to see any wrestling moves out of here. Whoa, oh. Right off that Throwing top up. rope. Oh, well, that's a classic move right there. Typical Jason style of match, like you said, Jeff. That's what he's all about. He is One thing you won't pound, see with Jason is wrestling moves. No, not at all. That's right. <laughs> like, like another ultimate warrior. <laughs> Knee right to the middle of the back. Second one. Tony Roy having the boots put to him right now. Let's we'll see what type of recover recuperative powers that Tony Roy has. Uh, one mention too, Bob. Uh, we got a second here. Is a little uh, congratulations out to a Continental employee, uh, Billy Wyatt, and his wife Bonnie. The birth of a new child. That's right. Is that right? That's, That's right. right. That means that Billy's father, who used to be one of my neighbors, is now a grandfather. That's but right. still not the oldest grandfather in Middleburg. Only no, dancing that, that Denny Butler. Denny Butler. That's right. That's correct. That's but right. he's married to the world's youngest grandmother. That's he's very unusual. Double, double axe. When a man that size comes off the top rope. That's vicious. That's incredible. Let me tell you. Tell you, Tony Roy's taking a lot of punishment so Jesus far. Stuck in the referee. That's a that's a big mistake, I think. Never put your Roy, hand on the official. With two straight punches to the stomach as Jason bent over a bit. Nice, nice move. little move. One thing that and an arm drag. One thing that he's gotta one thing that Tony Roy is gonna do. He's gotta keep his mind on Jason. Forget the bug. The bug is doing a pretty good job of distracting him at times. You gotta ignore the bug because if you keep your mind on the manager, you're not gonna win the match. Alright, two leg drops onto uh, the left arm of Jason the horrible. Uh, certainly has put Tony Roy back in command of this match at this moment. I think as Paul said earlier, though, is, is this hurting Jason? I mean, that's the question. Whoa, right I over the there. top rope. I mean, he was literally just thrown over the top rope right there, Paul. The concrete floor. Jason getting up on that top rope. <clears throat> Look at this guy. He's vicious. Referee warning oh, Jason. Look, you see what the bug did? He just put spewed some spray over there on Tony Roy. Oh, look at the bug. But that guy, we saw him in Marshfield too. He is obnoxious. A man like that has no place at ringside. 
We, we, I mean, we call Jimmy Hart and Bobby Heenan bad. That guy's terrible. He has some pretty impressive, has a pretty impressive nice looking uh, wrestler out there. Nice flying body press. You, know, you can't get Jason that easy. If you want to pin Jason the Horrible, you've got to really work him over. But like we said, a lot of this stuff may not even phase the man. Now, well, two yeah. punches to the back. All right, went to the far side of his chin. Oh, that's the Ric Flair move right there. I tell you, throw it into the ring post. We're right up over the top rope and out onto the floor. I tell you. go over to help out. I'll tell you something, if this was a battle royal, Tony would have it right now. I am very but, surprised that Tony Roy is taking it to Jason this well, so this early. Tony Roy is a superbly conditioned athlete. I think we can see that from here. Oh, he is. And I think the longer the match goes, it'll go in Tony Roy's favor. That's right, Jason, I've seen him in the past. He's used to just getting in there, rumbling, and getting it done. Roy is really working him over with the slow, methodical uh, type of wrestling, and Jason's not used to that. His concentration has been thrown off. Tony Roy trying to get the fans involved in the match by clapping. He has Jason bring him right over the top rope. And a nice move by Tony Roy. He's on top of him for the cover. Referee two. Oh. And he's thrown Whoa. off on the count of three. He kicked out with quite some authority. That's that a Nikolai Volkov uh, kick out. There right. certainly oh, exactly. was a little air time there, Paul. No pun intended, of course, right, Bob? Absolutely. Oh, now we're back to Jason's punch, punch to the back. I tell you, Jeff. Just pounding Follow Jason. Away Just pounding away at That's it. Slap to the chest by Jason. There's Tony Roy in the corner, just kind of dragging him out now. He's trying to take away that wall. Oh. Oh. And he hits him with that mask. Tony Roy goes in between oh, the top and the rope bucket and the middle right rope. With that swatter. This could be lights out for Mr. Roy. Ah. Jason getting practice for his next opponent, too. That reminds me of the missing link a little bit. Practicing on all the ring posts so far. He likes ring posts almost as much as the animal. George the Animal Steel, I was just going to say that. Yeah. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, the bug got the ring announcer a little bit up. Got a little trouble with Mel Simons. Not a good thing to do. You met Mel earlier. What's he like, Vic? Referee oh, cautioning Jason right now. Jason the Horrible. Mel, one of the finest ring announcers in wrestling. Besides myself, of course. Jason up on the ropes, exclaiming how good he is. Fans not showing him how good he is. Not everybody agreeing with him. Uh -oh. well, wait a minute. What's Tony uh -oh. Roy got on? Tony Roy. Tony Roy has now gone to soccer. Is that the sport? Uh oh, club? Tony Roy. Oh, he oh, just got the bug. the bug. He got the bug. He's, He's doing a job raid. on the bug. Unbelievable. They may call this a no contest. The bug has been right. bagged on that side yeah, of the ring. That's a cross man. That's what it looks like, yeah. I don't know, they all look alike to me, Paul. It's a piece of sports game. Oh. Ah, head to the stomach. Oh. Oh. Butt to the head. Oh. Coco butt, yes, sir. Tony Roy. Fans love it. Oh, indeed. Take it into Jason. Jason has a move for a couple of seconds. There's some movement right there. Nice. Tony Roy with that helmet back on He's again. the cobwebs in the attic right now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jason's in control again. Jason's upset now. You can tell. Watch this one. Oh, nailed him with the helmet. Disqualification. Oh, I don't know, Vic. Tony Roy is one who brought that into the ring. Uh, yeah, I'll tell you, if you didn't need dental work before, you might have needed it afterwards. Tony Roy being placed up on the top rope. Jason's famous oh, for this. Jason's got something in mind here. Oh. Oh. Double That's axe usually, handle to the stomach. That's usually how he ends a match. I mean, imagine if Tony can come back from this. Fans chanting, Tony, Tony, Tony. Trying to exhort Tony Roy on. Whoa. A nice suplex by Jason. He has him down, pin of one. That's it. Grabbing a chunk of hair. Jason pulled him up on that. He had the three count. Jason does that a lot. I saw him wrestle David Jones in Marshfield. He did the same thing. Likes to pull his opponents up and just punish them until they can't stand no more. Throwing him into the ropes. Oh. Hits him with a choke hold. He continues to choke now. 
Oh, the bug uh, stopped something with the ref there. Oh, was that Jason that girl who pulled the leg again. of the referee, though? That's what the bug's saying. The bug's saying that little girl pulled the ref's legs. <laughs> Highly unlikely. Tony Roy taking a little bit of a beating now. Nice slap to the chest. It's reminiscent of Ric Flair, those big chops. Now, Jason's taking over completely now in this match. Like I said from the outset, Jason is just too vicious for this young kid. He's good, but I think it's Jason all the uh -oh. way. Uh-oh. Just the throw him right out of the ring. That's an automatic disqualification. That's over the top. No, this is an NWA, Paul. That's automatic. That should be automatic. Announcer. I don't care what level. Whoa, Bill Simons is getting into the act. Referee is outside. Jason is up on the third rope. Oh, no. If he comes down, then this is over. I Tony think was on the move. Tony had a little presence of mind to keep on moving. Jason's following him around. Sign of a good wrestler. He knows where he is at all times. <laughs> referee seems to be in better control of this match than the other referee was in the last match. That's for Indeed. sure. Oh, Mel Simon just kicked the bug. Uh -oh. Jason's standing right above him, though. I don't know if he sees that. That's what I like about Mel. He's a no-nonsense winger. Uh-oh, here we go. Referee just can't control. Tony's looking for his spot. He gets it. Oh. He's got him hung up. He's tied in the rope. Now you're going to take advantage of Jason here. That's right. Now it's time to rip that mask off and punch his face out. This That's what they got to do. This is just a break that Tony Roy needed. Tony Roy just putting the boots back to Jason the Horrible. And putting some more pressure on those ring ropes. The ball tried to get him ball. free. Okay, Paul. Get you right in here. And uh, yeah, Paul Rose was taking away, Bob. Okay, right now, Jason just got hit over the head uh, by Tony Roy, but it looks like a double count out right now. Hey, we have Paul Rose with us, the uh, organizer of this event with the uh, police union. Uh, Paul, how, what did it take to put this on? <laughs> a 15 lot. minutes, right, Paul? <laughs> yeah. uh, it took a lot of effort and a lot of help, but it pulled through. Looks like a pretty successful evening so far. How many yeah. of your fellow officers are here tonight, Paul? I've got about 18, about 18 officers here. I've got about eight or nine outside in the parking lots protecting the vehicles and here with the wrestlers in the rings. So there's a lot of cooperation that's gone on uh, throughout the police department and putting a, uh, an event of this magnitude on in this town. Uh, for a lot of cooperation on our officers as well as the uh, businessmen for supporting us and placing the ads to, to uh, help pay for the wrestlers. Okay, Paul, what, just quickly, what do you do with the money now? We know you give it to charities and you, uh... Well, the monies, we, uh... We donate monies to, uh, organizations that are... don't have the funds to operate sometimes. We donate it to the park department, uh... to, uh, scholarship funds. We're gonna be taking over the, uh, scholarship funds that the association used to run, as well as the, uh... Uh, fire and police uh, softball leagues. Uh, money's going to a lot of good uh, causes. But, uh, I'll tell you right now, Paul, you've done one hell of a job here. Bob commented on, uh, as he came in here, he's about as many people he's ever seen in his gymnasium. <laughs> I'd like to see this many people into boys and girls basketball games during the winter, I'll tell you that. It certainly would help it, wouldn't it? It sure nope. would. And I would like to give good thanks to the uh, cable uh, company and all of this. Their staff has given us a great support in this, uh, this effort as well. And John Hills is back in his video check class. Okay, let me get back right. out there. Thank you a lot, Paul. Let's get back to the ring for the action. And we've had a lot of action going on in here. A lot of give and take between these two wrestlers. What do you think, Vicious Vic? I think Tony Roy is getting the crowd behind him. He's looking good. He may just pull out a win here tonight. Now, uh, right now, Jason, Jason seems to be a little on Queer Street. I'm not quite sure on that one, but they're going, for, they're going for the test of strength right here. This will be an interesting match up here. Both wrestlers leaning on each other. The fatigue's starting to show, I think, in both men, particularly Jason. We can't see his face, but his body seems a little bit more limp than it did earlier in the match. Uh, 
Jason seems to have the upper hand here. Well, I'll tell you right now, Tony's going a lot further than I thought he was going to go. Oh. Smash to the hands. That's smart. Well, I'll tell you, those things do hurt. All right, just taking that arm and throwing it into that steel turnbuckle. Congratulations, Bill. Thank you. Well, first one arm, then the other. And he's going now. after those fingers again. Although it's one of the smallest body parts, a man could submit with the That's amount right. of pain in that finger that Tony yeah. Roy is right now experiencing. No padding on those fingers. Oh, what a flop. Oh. That's a nice hip throw all the way across the ring. Still tossed, Tony, tossed him like a little boy. Tony's trying to get a little feeling back in his hands right now. Jason going to work on those fingers and the wrist right now. Going for the wrist lock, reverse wrist lock. Well, Jason's found a weakness. He's going after it. He's bending well, he, that arm backwards. He's spinning it right back. I don't think I've ever seen a hand in that position before. I hope Tony's double natural, jointed. Anyways. <laughs> Okay, hard slap onto the back of Tony Roy, knocks him down. Jason with a kick right in the face, right under the chin. Jason kind of strutting around the ring right now. Reaches down, grabs Tony by the hair, pulls him up, going for a body slam right now. That just oh. may do it. The big man's going up. Going for the third rope right now. Now, this is a bad move. This is a bad move on Jason's part. He's taking too much time getting much up there. Much too much time. He's much, much too big to be up there. There he goes. Oh, Tony oh. caught him. Tony Roy caught him and threw him right out of the top rope and out of the ring and onto the floor. Our cable cameras are right over there right now catching this action. Bug hustling over to pick up Jason the Horrible. Tony Roy exhorting the crowd on. Uh, the bug stalling for time. A very good move on the bug's part. There is no timeouts in the squared circle, Jeff. Unless you make them. <laughs> bug trying to get, grab Dave Stewart's uh, leg and pull him down. Referee Dave Stewart. Again, the, the bug breaking the count, which is very good. He's giving Jason some time to recover. Jason, Jason seems to be picking up more momentum. Seems a little dazed. I wouldn't want to be in the front row right now. Jason was dazed when he came to the ring. <laughs> That's true too, Paul. <laughs> Jason, I think, was practicing headbutts on the wall inside. We got it. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Tony Roy being dragged out. He really flew twist. that time, didn't he? The bug kicking away at Tony Roy now that Tony's down on the floor. Tony Roy up. So as Tony, Tony gets up, where does the bug go? <laughs> Jason grabs a handful of hair, pulls him back into the ring, running the ropes. Oh. He gets a bear hug on him right now. Belly, 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 belly to belly, belly suplex. Two times. He's out to punish. He's out to punish him. He's Again, going he's up going to up. The third rope. See what type of what type of move he comes off with. A very dangerous move for any wrestler. Oh. Oh. He nailed it. He I think him. he just grounded flying. Three. And that's the match. Jason the horrible. The flying leap off the top rope. Oh, Jason's not done. Oh, Jason oh, throws, throws him out right in front of our cable cameras. Uh oh. I don't think Jason likes this guy either. Oh, oh. He's hitting everybody. Oh, Vic may have to be pressed back into service. He went after the ring announcer. I bet you Mel Simons didn't count on this for the evening. Oh, Dave dirty Stewart pool. being thrown out. Lug is hitting him with his own shoe. Here comes some help Here from some of the other wrestlers. The Let's Jason has gone completely out of his mind. The bug, the bug is trying to be pulled off. It's taking three people to pull Jason the Horrible off of Mel Simons, who appears to be injured very badly out on the mat. The bug is being pushed back into the locker room. We may need a stretcher out here. Dave Stewart being thrown out, almost thrown out of the ring. Jason is rolling. This is disgusting. Jason is rolling. Mel Simons over. Trying to inflict more pain on him. Mel Simons is in no shape or, or condition to be wrestling against a man like Jason the Horrible.
As Tony runs over to cover Mel Simon, what a despicable display. I have never seen anything like it. He throws his arms up in a, in a victorious gesture, and we all know that's wrong. Jason the Horrible staring into the Continental Cable cameras, going out as the victor in this match. But our concern right now is not for Jason, it's for the announcer, Mel Simons, who's down on the mat, is attacked viciously by Jason the Horrible. What Paul, I've never what seen anything like never, that. Never, never on a ringer announcer. That's no, no excuse for it whatsoever. The only time I've ever seen this happen was when I was a little boy, Paul. Going back to the wrestling, and Sam Menica used to be the uh, ring announcer for Big Time Wrestling out of Boston. And he was attacked many times by the very person who puts this show on, Waldeck Killer Kowalski. They may need a stretcher to get him out of here. They better be careful moving him, too. Who knows what damage the Jason's looks like on Mel. Now that they can't get him over the top rope or the bottom rope. Ah, there's oh, Victor Vic's, uh, Geister. Vic, Victor's Vic there it. trying to help out also. I think Victor's looking for the microphone right now. <laughs> I think Vic's going to have to take over for Mel. There's a big round of applause for Mel Simons as he's being led out of the ring. He looks kind of in tough shape. I'm sure he has great recuperative powers. Tony Roy leaving the ring trying to help out in this situation. A brutal attack on Mel Simons by Jason the Horrible. Unprovoked, unprovoked attack. Unprovoked attack. It looks like Vic's going to have to take over here. 